Hey guys, welcome to another Farming Simulator video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the aquarium video, but it was absolutely amazing. It's definitely worth a visit if you're ever near Toronto. So someone asked recently where and what mods I use. So I said I'll do a rundown in the, the next video I do. So here we go. The Mercedes Benz Trek 1800 intercooler that is on Farming Simulator's main website, the mod host thing. There, the front weight here, the Easy Mass, made by Ego Modeling. That is found on modhoster.com. As is this trailer here, this by Ego Modeling, found on Modhoster. The Combine, John Deere Combine, I have two of them here. The S650 is made by Big Boss Modding. You can download that from their website. BigBossModeling.com I believe it is a mod hoster and probably most of the Farming Sim websites. The John Deere I have here is made by Ego Modeling again, found on Mod Hoster. The Mercedes Trek 1600 Turbo. It's made by M oh BM, I can't remember. MB modeling and bottom there. Or BM modeling, one of the two. It's found on Farmer Sims website again. And that's just a stock equipment. Auto tractor and auto combine found on mod hoster also. This little guy is don't really sort of think is that great, but it is in its own way. Uh, that's found on, I found it on Alice2013, I believe it's .com. Uh, again, it's got a front loader attachment. That site I don't really like using, because I find they steal people's mods without giving the original link. Um, everybody knows this tractor, or should know of it, it's one of the first mods that ever come out for Farmer Simulator 2013, and is found on Farming Simulator's website, front end loader, very very good one. So that sums it up really. Now I've got many 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 other mods on my home computer, bear in mind. Right now I'm not at home, I'm in Canada, so... I've got many mods on there. But these are just the main ones. I have even look around the farmyard quick, but uh, I've got this actually. That's the uh, on FSUK some um, fertilizer mod. I can't remember the name of it though. I've not really used it. Stock uh, spray. And really, I honestly think that is it. That's stock. Yeah, that is. So there you go, as promised. Walk through of all the equipment I have in Farmer Simulator. On this map, anyway. Also, I uh, saw someone saying about it. it's not very good for course play. So it actually comments quite a lot. And no doubt, I've never played with course play. I don't even know where you download it from. Probably mod hoster, so I've got no experience with it whatsoever. They're saying about uh, dumping, the grain can be an issue because of 
the traffic because it's right by the roadside. Like in real life, they do dump it right by the roadside in there. I can understand that being uh, an issue. Only th two things I can suggest is either switching your traffic off completely, or m there is some bin storage you can get for fields. I can't remember what side it's from, but you'll be able to find it in just like the stock sides. Try putting it in a better location than the farmyard, maybe. They work independently of the main stuff on the PDA, though. So you just have to bear that one in mind. But for me at the minute just selling stuff just doesn't really matter. Right now I'm hauling barley. That's <laughs> the lowest. 160 a ton. Going through the gate when I pass it, as I was going to do the. What's the best? Canola's up. Whoa. In the course play, you could do what I'm about to do now, and that's directing through this. Like so. Or oh, I know you can make them back in or something. Like I say, I've got no experience with cosplay. And now we just sit here and wait. So, spinning tires. Only one that's on the Facebook page. Just type in Landy Kid on Facebook, you'll find the Facebook page. If you're on Facebook, that is. I have purchased spinning tires. I was always led to believe that I did the uh, Kickstarter. I was almost 100% I did. They have no records of it, and neither do I, so if I did, I've lost out. But if they've got no records, I trust them. Um, PayPal would have been the way I did it, and there's nothing on there, so... Unfortunately, it looks like I didn't. But you can pre-order it on Steam. They said they weren't going to do that, but you can. I think you get a discount of 10%. And it worked out to be like $17, I believe, when I went to do it, or £17 UK, I think it was actually, not dollars.
it's definitely going to be a worthwhile game, and there will be a lot of videos out. And I may come away from farming sim for a little while to do some videos of that, but that'll be a game where it's going to be changing daily because I'm not going to be doing the same sort of thing. It's depending on how it is, whether they've actually got objectives in it or whether it's just a kind of free room at the minute still. I don't know. From the videos I'm seeing online, so there was one guy putting videos out. <coughs> Sorry about that. It's almost like it's kind of looks free roaming, but you've got objectives that you can do if you like. But they have got physical damage showing it, winching, towing, trains. When it hits, the people that got pre release like the modders, a lot of the modders have got pre release So they've probably been working on mods already. Yeah, that'd be good. I'm not sure if the mods that are out at the minute will come across into this, though. So I'm guessing they will, but don't quote me. This is malfunction up there. Spinning Tires is also supposed to have a multiplayer too. Don't know how true that is. Or whether it's just local, sort of on your home network, or internet based, or what the dealio is at the minute. get this field done quite quick actually, surprising. I haven't played it anymore since. sit here and watch the scenery. Now, each time I go out do stuff like the aquarium, I'll be posting videos, more than likely. I'm enjoying doing that and from what I've seen you guys are enjoying seeing it. Back up, see how this guy's doing. Usually, I stop and lay the shaft down like that, but it's the auto combine kicking it in each time, so I just can't be asking. Maybe, maybe just over half. Coming up to the 15 minutes anyway. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, I will catch you tomorrow with another farming sim video. Leaving off probably right where you see the tractors now.
Tschüss, Leute.